Today I'm going to be getting our mailbox installed and thought that I would bring you along. So let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do here is get the hole dug. So I've got my post hole diggers here. It's going to be kind of a pain getting through this gravel, but we'll make do. Once you get past that gravel layer, it's not too bad of a dig, but still kind of a lot of work. All right, to help with drainage, I've got a little bit of gravel mix here. I'm just kind of going to put a little bit down there in the bottom. Just a little. And then I'm going to get this post put in here. Okay, now I'm going to get the dirt raked in here. Now you can take the other end of your shovel and kind of tap that down. Kind of get things from moving around too much. Now before I do too much of that, I'm gonna take a level. I'm gonna see if this thing is straight up and down here. Right there. Okay, that ought to do it. Now the mail carrier asked that I put the box 41 inches from the ground. So I'm gonna measure out here where 41 is. Now that's gotta be the bottom of the box itself. So I've pre-cut a board here with two 45s on it. And that's gonna be used as the support up under the box. So I'm gonna take a drill bit here and pre-drill some holes. For my screws to go into. So I know that this is gonna go here and the mailbox is gonna go at this point. So I need to find a spot down here where the mailbox will be at 41. So. I'm thinking somewhere about right there. So I'm gonna get this screwed in here. Oops. Of course I'm using outdoor screws. So now I've got my top board here. Now it's too long, but I'm gonna cut it down once it's been installed here. So this should allow me to find a level spot, which is right there where it should be. Now I'm gonna try and come in from an angle here and toenail some screws. See how well that works. Not too bad. Now the actual board the mailbox is gonna rest on is right here. So I just wanna bring this all the way back to those screws there. And I'm going to mark where it attaches here. And then I'm just gonna take the saw and cut the board off right below that. Now this board I've got pre-drilled and so I'm just gonna take some three inch screws here
can connect this piece to that bottom part. Make sure it's nice and secure here. Now the last thing to do is get the mailbox itself set up here. Now this board is actually cut very snug here. So it's just gonna pop on. I'm gonna push it back as far as it'll let me here. And then I'm just gonna take a couple of small wood screws here and uh, put them in on the side to keep the box in place here. And there we have it, one completely installed mailbox. So I believe that's gonna be plenty secure enough for what we're gonna be doing with it. So one last thing that has to be done here is shave off this back pole a little bit. So let me do that real quick and then we're done. I have the saw set to 45 here. I'm just gonna make two cuts along this to get this angle down here. Well, and that's how I install my mailbox. The video was a bit rushed because I'm going out to supper with my wife, but had to get this done. Thanks for watching. I'm Seth Johnson with Land House, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.